Well, we are seeing fantastic weather this morning. There is a lot of sunshine and all of that sunshine is going to continue throughout the day today and clear skies will continue into the evening. Here is a quick look at the Warren weather camera where the sun's been shining here for the last uh, few hours and it's going to be a great day. Honestly, uh, just about uh, the weather will be just uh, like it was yesterday, a couple degrees warmer as far as those temperatures go. Speaking of temperatures, it's 51 in Stoneboro, 55 at the airport, 56 in Sebring. Local radar has nothing going on and you'll see why here because on the national radar we have this high pressure system pretty much right over our area now i do want to point out this weak cool front uh, back here in minnesota and in canada this will move closer to our area over the next 24 uh, hours and it'll actually bring some clouds into our area tomorrow it won't be completely overcast but some partly cloudy skies and a very small chance of some sprinkles maybe a light rain shower but as far as today goes this afternoon high temperatures will be in the upper 70s east liverpool could at 80 degrees and then later on tonight temperatures are going to drop back off into the mid 50s mid to upper 50s so it'll actually be warmer uh, the, uh, for tomorrow morning than it was this morning then watch by noon some of those clouds start to come in like i was talking about temperatures right around 80 degrees by noon so you can already tell that we are warming up uh, with those temperatures now here is a more like sort of a regional view of the future tracker notice tomorrow at noon from Detroit to Grand Rapids, there are some areas of showers there. As these pass over Lake Erie, they really uh, start to weaken significantly, but the model's still painting a couple of those showers in our area. There's a lot of dry air in the atmosphere. Not sure how much of this will hit the ground, but there's going to be some partly cloudy skies. Very small chance of an isolated shower. It wouldn't amount to much if we actually got one. For tonight, mostly clear conditions for high school football. It's going to be great out there. Temperatures dropping down into the 60s eventually. High pressure system is really going to strengthen into our area area to the start of the work week that is going to bring the chance of some 90 degree plus temperatures this is a look at the highs and low temperatures in red that's the daily record high temperatures so this weekend we're not going to break any records monday the record high is 94 my forecast high temperature is 90 so decently close there certainly going to be warm on tuesday the record high is nearly 100 degrees there not going to break it but it's going to be 92 degrees on tuesday that's a high temperature right now 91 on wednesday Kind of close to a record. I think we'll stay below the record heat, but might be close on a couple of those days. Seven-day outlook here. Mostly sunny in 88 Sunday. And then Labor Day there, mostly sunny. High temperature at around 90 degrees. So it'll feel more like July 4th on Labor Day. 92 on Tuesday with mostly sunny skies. Then some clouds begin to come in here on Wednesday, partly cloudy, and there is a very small chance of a shower or storm on Thursday, which will help out with that heat a little bit.